Hi, welcome to Devlog 5 of my Gorilla Tag fan game. In today's video, we're going to be adding a sort of Floor is Lava game mode. Unlike my first, or technically fourth, Devlog, I'm not going to yap for three hours about my life story. So, sit back and enjoy! So, I think what I'm going to do is, in Forest, I'm going to make a little like room or a box area. Uh, is it gonna be like an ice theme? Because I don't want to copy like floors lava. That's uh, that's pretty basic. So what you're gonna do is there's gonna be a there's gonna be a giant like icicle, and you're gonna put hot coals on it, and it, and it'll melt and it'll basically rise. And maybe if you touch it, you'll get like frozen or something. So right now I'm just gonna make the room. So is your edge loop? I don't know the size of my own character model, so that might be good. Now we just reverse extrude, and boom, we have a hallway. So I have finished the hallway. There's a little bit of kind of see through the map. I'm gonna fix that later. But we at there's lights, and then a new light variant. It's blue, and it has an icicle out of it. And if you can see the light that it emits is kind of bluish, other than it's normal white. There's some snow that makes a new hit sound sound effect. Uh, more icicles just on the walls. Uh, dimmer new lights and this it's it's a blast door so basically what's gonna happen is once the round or yeah once the round is started the icicle melts this door is it's gonna be down and then it's gonna like it's gonna close so like you can't just come through the hallway and then join or just jump in the water mid-match so, we just have some snow on the ground and the main icicle, which is going to melt. Um, I'm probably going to add a like a little campfire kind of thing right here, and you're gonna be able to like, grab underneath of it, and you'll get like a hot coal, just like in Gorilla Tag, how you grab like snow, or if you're there in the you know volcano update, you grab like the rocks out of the bucket. So you do that, and you throw, and you just throw it on here, and then. If once you do it a few times, the the round would basically start. So that's just pretty basic. So I'm gonna work on more scripting, and then I'll get back to you. Good night. Uh, I started working on this maybe at like I don't know nine o'clock, but got it all working. It's all networked. Uh, there's sounds, rises, you know, what it's supposed to do. So. You see here, there's an eruption percent and a max eruption percent. If I set the eruption percent to like five, it slowly goes down or like refreezes. And there's like little particles on the actual thing. Like it kind of like melting, like water dripping off. Uh, so it'll slowly go back down to zero. You'll throw the, the hot coals or whatever on it. And it'll basically add it, add like add up. So if I set it to 15, the door closes right here, can't get in, and then the ice or well, whatever, it starts rising and you can kind of swim in it. It's really just zero gravity right now, but it'll rise. Um, oh yeah, and I extended the map so it's taller now. So it takes a second to rise. So as you can see, it stopped, and now it's gonna wait a little bit. So, and then it, it, um, it, and then it goes back down faster. Um, I don't think you could hear it, but it plays like a little alarm sound, and now it's playing like a little draining sound. So you'll be, able, it'll drain, and then the door will open, and then you'll be able to uh, just basically reset it and do do it again so you can't hear it but i added a sound effect to the door and i also made a like flowing water effect when the water is rising my microphone audio didn't record for this part but basically all i did was add the holdable part of the molten rocks or well hot coals i just added the mesh and texture and made sure it worked with the melting ice system and made sure it actually added heat on the like on the script
So I added like kind of wooden supports or like, not supports, but like structures. So you, like you can be at the bottom and you can like climb on the structures and get away from the whatever. Basically, I just like scattered a bunch around. I made like a few base models and I just copied them. I also made the map bigger so it's like kind of small and then it gets bigger and then it gets smaller again. Pretty much all I did is just, yeah, take them and paste them. Make sure you could like hop hop on them and it wasn't like too impossible to make it up here you could already make it up here without really needing these but it's just to make it like f make the map flow better also um i don't the uh you can't tell because i i can't get in vr but i added like a swimming mechanic to the lava which or i guess not lava i don't know what i'm gonna call this thing but basically, it's just like a pretty basic swimming thing. It's kind of like no gravity, but you can like move with your arms. So here, let me just, if I trigger it, the player, it enters. And, and if I like move the controller, it's kind of like a zero gravity state. But if, if I ever get in VR, then you'll be able to move because it tracks your, based on your controllers, not really based off the movement of the actual ha game objects. So what I think I'm going to do is instead of making you, like, swim in the water, I think you're just going to, like, teleport away, like, out of the, out of the floor's lava room, like, just, like, over here, so you have to wait for the, uh, for it to reset. The reason behind that is I'm probably going to put a, a cosmetic or something that you can get, like, so, so there's, like, an actual reason to play this, but yeah, there's probably gonna be, like, a cosmetic up here that you're gonna be able to get, and, yeah, if you can just swim, then there's really no point. And it's finished. The game mode is called f uh, Frostburn because it's like ice or whatever. I can't show you the cosmetic because it would ruin the surprise. Currently, it's insanely laggy on Quest, so I'm working on a fix. I have no idea what's wrong. So if you happen to know, please leave a comment. It would really help. Uh, I know the download link was broken on the last video, but it should work now. Um, and I think that's it. Subscribe, join the Discord, and haha, yes.